I started paying attention to Supreme probably around 2005 when they opened their LA shop. Before that, it was New York only. I tried to hold off on buying decks for as long as possible because I knew once I started, I'd have to have them all. It's the first complete collection out there, period. And it's gonna be up at Sotheby's in New York in January. It was kind of like a race. Like I knew there was a couple of other dudes who were close to completing the whole collection. Once I had the thing completed, I wanted to get it up on display. I just figured auctioning the collection, like why not send it to somebody else that will continue collecting and just build on it. It starts with the first decks that released, 98, and then just works its way down around the gallery with the newest decks on the front wall. And they've already collaborated with a lot of the artists that I did. My favorite of all of them, I would say, is the condo set. I've always been a big fan of George Condo's art. Those are dope. That's a set that I'll definitely buy again after I auction the entire collection. I gotta have those. The Last Supper set I released was a five deck set. And there were two different Jesus decks. One that was a US release and then the Japan release version right here. The Dan Colon set. That was the hardest one for me to acquire. I've had the other four for some time, you know, it was just that last one that I couldn't find it. It was nowhere. There it is. I would say this is probably one of the most difficult sets to complete. I've only seen probably two, maybe three other completed collections of this set ever. You know, with the cruiser decks, I've never seen anybody else with a completed set. This is the one and only that I've ever seen. They just do not pop up. This, along with the 2010 yellow and black set, are just impossible to find. I was lucky enough to find this one. It was gripped, it was skated. Luckily it wasn't shredded, you know, it's still, it's still in pretty damn good shape, but it's either that or nothing. So I went with it. After seeing them all hung up like this, you know, it's, it's, it's a little bit more difficult to let them go. When they were all just stacked in my room collecting dust, it ain't no big deal. But now that they're up and on display and I see them like this, it's like, damn. That's a wrap, baby.